Hello everyone, welcome once again to my channel DIY Repairs. Today we are going to see how a pendulum of a quartz clock works and how we can repair both pendulum and quartz clock. First of all, take out this pendulum. For taking out this pendulum, just push it, uh, push it upward and take it out. A permanent magnet attached here, you will see. This is the permanent magnet. Now open uh, this box. So this circuit also have one coil, you will see back side, uh, a crystal oscillator and a chip. You also notice uh, another circuit, uh, that is this one, it is actually uh, for pendulum. And this circuit has nothing to do with this circuit. These two wires are connected with this circuit, just only for power supply. If we cut here and directly give the power supply from the battery, these two point of battery, it also works. This is the actual circuit of pendulum. It has uh, two capacitor, one bipolar transistor and one resistance and a coil. It has two coil, both are winded one above another. So let us see the circuit. So uh, this is the circuit of uh, pendulum. You will uh, see this is a bipolar transistor. This value is uh, BC459. And uh, these are two coils L1 and L2. Which is, um, this is binding one over another. L1 is up on upside and L2 is on downside and um, both value is 1000 bindings on 4mm dia core. Now see how uh, this uh, pendulum circuit works. So you will see uh, this coil actually so uh, on this dia both these coil L1 and L2 are winded one over another and then it is connected to circuit at these points. Actually this uh, uh, L1 coil acts as a sensor when this permanent uh, magnet come near this uh, uh, L1 coil, it, uh, the circuit get energizes and the second coil L2 acts as an electromagnet and it pushes the pendulum further away and this process goes on and the pendulum moves to and fro. So if this circuit is not working then we can check it by multimeter and the continuity of coils and this transistor. See, uh, this is all right. Okay, so both the uh, coils are okay. Now, for checking the transistor, you will see this is a uh, bipolar transistor, and these are connected at this point. So we can check the transistor.
so you will see transistor is also all right if any of the component is uh, uh, not working you can easily replace it now see how to uh, ch check this uh, main circuit so for checking this main circuit first of all check uh, this coil this is connected at these two points so check the continuity of the coil see uh, it's showing that coil is all right second if coil is all right then check this uh, oscillator oscillator actually this crystal oscillator has a thin crystal of piezoelectric material vibrating between two electrodes when current is passed through it so sometimes this uh, piezoelectric material which is vibrating inside got struck and the crystal does not working so in that case uh, by giving mechanical stress to uh, this crystal by hitting just like uh, we hit caramel striker like this it will start working you can also uh, check these two point uh, for any corrosion if there is corrosion you can just simply rubbing it you can make it corrosion free if uh, all these component like coil and this crystal is all right but still uh, the watch does not working so we have to replace this whole circuit just you can take it out this whole circuit and we can uh, replace this whole